It was the fastest bomber on Earth, a Cold War marvel. Then it disappeared. The B-58 Hustler broke 19 world records in the 1960s, a true engineering triumph. Yet, this magnificent aircraft was retired after just 10 years. Why? The core issue was that the B-58 was a failed concept from the start, built for one very specific mission, high altitude, high speed nuclear delivery with an external bomb. This strategy worked until the Soviets developed advanced surface to air missiles like the SA-2, which could reach those extreme altitudes, making the Hustler's primary advantage obsolete. The Air Force tried adapting it to low altitude penetration, but the B-58 wasn't designed for it, proving unstable and difficult to handle at lower levels. Operationally, it was three times more expensive than the B-52, demanding constant temperamental maintenance. With a high accident rate and unforgiving controls, its complexity and tricky fuel management made it a challenging, dangerous aircraft to fly. Ultimately, the rise of ICBMs and the Air Force's need for more versatile bombers with greater range and payload made the B-58's limited utility simply unsustainable. This supersonic wonder was simply outpaced by rapid strategic changes. 